right, I'm here with Mark. I'm here with Joe. How are you guys? Fine, thank you. How are you? He speaks for me. <laughs> oh, He's so, stressed. Yes, I see the little twinkle in the eyes because there's a lot going Is it on. A twinkle or a twitch? <laughs> well, <laughs> what would you say? It's a bit of both, to be honest. I'm delighted to be here, that's all I'm saying. Yeah, it's going to happen here tonight. It's been mayhem in Belgium for the past couple of days because so many listeners have been trying to get their tickets for this exclusive occasion. You're going to play in this very small venue. What do you think? What do you think of the room? I love it. <clears throat> Thank you. <laughs> no, thank you in advance. How long has it been since you've played a gig this intimate? Probably the uh, first gig since COVID at the Louis. That was, that was the last time we did oh. something small and intimate. Yeah. Probably an inappropriate time to do something intimate. On my birthday, right? 23rd of August, 2021. <laughs> Don't incriminate us, Joe, it's but yes. It's been a while. It was legal, Bo, <laughs> for fuck's sake. It's okay. It's all water under the bridge. But it's the type of gig where spit could be exchanged. You know, you're going to see the audience from very up close. They're going to see every little twinkle or twitch in your eyes. And I think if I were an artist that those are the best possible gigs. But is that the case? Um, I think there are many types of good gigs. Um, ours is one of them. We were just speaking affectations on Lana Del Rey earlier on, which is a very different kind of show. And I'm sure oh God. there's merit in both. I don't know what to say because I've listened, to, I went, um, I was running today in the park. I was listening to your new album and then afterwards Lana Del Rey to compensate. The warm down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Sick. So it's funny that you mention it. Do you know she's going to, uh, she, she's going to release an album this year? Don't threaten us like that, Lana. It's going to be a country album. Is it? It's going to be called Lasso. It's just hot. It's just news. I just read it. Lasso. La Lasso. <laughs> Let's talk about um, the new album. Congre Which one? Which Lana's Lasso. Lasso. <laughs> yeah. That's coming in September, by the way. Can you stop plugging someone else's yeah, album actually, on our time, actually. please, Michelle? I'm very sorry. Let's get back to the case. Which is Tank. 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 Wait, one, two, three. Tank. Tank. It's such a gorgeous album. Congratulations, you guys, on that one. Thank You're going to be playing how many songs of the album here tonight with Five. us? Five. Five of the 11 new songs. Uh, yes. Yes. And how excited are you guys? How stressed maybe even because it's the very first time you're going to play them. Do you know what? I'm incredibly excited. It's a lot of work's gone into this and I think we will reap the benefit and reward tonight. And the audience will also too. Do you know what I mean? I'm, so, I'm sorry, like, I guess I've got to like fight her. Or it's, a, like that, it's a game of two halves. So it's I was a football halves. pundit. Yeah. I mean, I'm not excited. When's this coming up? This, this show? Tomorrow. People are, people are seeing this tomorrow. Well, the songs you have cleared... You will have cleared by then, <laughs> so I hope you're, okay, you're going to clear fine. everything. <laughs> then people, will, yeah, okay. So people will know that it's the first time and that we're terrible at playing them at the moment. But we will be better by the time you come and see our show mm -hmm. in March. March. In you're going to love the three songs that you hear. <laughs>
There's unknown and new pressures to playing new songs that are unwelcome because we pride ourselves on working hard. And the concept of that is that you put a lot of hours in. Mm -hmm. So the first time you play anything is the least amount of time you put into it. So it's like my ethic is that it's, it's just not the best. But I will give it everything and love it. I'm just mm -hmm. saying, I'm not going to lie to you guys. Me and Michelle are going to have a terrible night. <laughs> and Bowen is going to have a, a great night. I'm a blast. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah, yeah. The you're just happy to be the You're just happy to get in sleep, aren't you, brother? Yeah. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. No, I totally understand. How different is the setup for the new Tank songs on stage? Uh, this, this is your department. Yes. Completely. Well, you've, you've heard the album. There's a, there's a lot going yeah, on. There's exactly. a lot of information. Yes. So it was, it's kind of about how we translate that into an idol show because yes. no one wants to see us like standing like craft work and kind of pushing you know, buttons noodling. playing that's samples a yeah. show. that's a very different show Bowen yeah. do you know what I mean it's a very different show it's got to be it's got to be like idols always is you know that's what people come for so it's a lot of dancing there's a mm -hmm. lot of like strict kind of where you got to be at the right point um, but it's, it's it's coming together mm -hmm. yes it is I mean <laughs> I'm, I'm not dancing I've got, I've got too many lyrics to remember. I've only sang the songs like eight times each. Oh, wow. That's not a lot, is it? Since, Since you recorded it, them. As in including recording. Wow. Because I sang it once and then that was it. Because it was on the spot that you came up with the lyrics, right? If I'm not mistaken, Good for the most part. Michelle. All of them. Wow, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Do you have the lyrics somewhere? In, or are you going to improvise? What no. happens when you don't remember... Worst case scenario. That's a good. That's a good question and a relevant one because I will forget. I don't improvise as in, I do improvise, but not not coherent words. It just comes out like noise. But you'll hear it tonight. Okay, let's find out. Yeah. Idols.
Thank you. Hello everyone. We are uh, idols.
very lucky in all seriousness now we're all, we've, we're very very lucky to be here to be able to tour as a, as a band and do this and it's the best job in the world and we're very very grateful to be back um i cannot wait these these songs are like our best songs and we've got to do them justice yeah. that's the thing there's a there's a pressure coming from us because we're like there's a new kind of aspect to our band where there's there's excellence, there's prowess in what we're doing, there's accomplishment in, in the musicality and what we're doing, and we really want to convey that wow. in our performance. That's why we seem a little stressed, because we just want to make sure people feel what we're intending with the songs. I think it's okay with the stress. You don't seem stressed at all. You seem very proud. I love the words that you just used. I'm, I'm, like, a, I'm like a duck <laughs> and an iceberg. Do you know what I mean? I'm like a big ducky <laughs> iceberg right now. You know, what you're seeing so on you, the surface. Your head's small, but you're fat. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, there's dump in the trunk and I've got webbed feet and I like bread. I love bread. <laughs> you love bread. Quack, quack, my good man. You love the bread. I mean, that is you. You're a duck. On an iceberg. What am I? I think I'm a sad act. you're, a, you're right. a pig version of Lana Del Rey. Pig, as I was going to say. Oh, we just talked about pigs and farmers. That's a compliment. I got, six, are, I got yeah. six boobies. How many boobs has a, a pig got? Six, I'd say. Six. I'm bringing sixy back. Sorry. I want to talk about the Lotto Arena where you're going to play for 8,000 people. Is it? In Belgium, indoor. Last time you were here. Is it? Is it? It is. The last time you were here it was the AB, it was August 2022. There were 2,000 people there. So it's quadrupled. Quadrupled, exactly. That's the word in English. Hey. <laughs> so, how does that feel embarking on your biggest indoor um, tour ever in Idol's history? It's, it's, it's a madness. dream. It's a dream. It's a dream. 
very, very happy. I didn't know that we were playing to. So I'm kind of, I'm, I'm processing that right now, Michelle. Yes. Feels good. Yeah, man. When can we see you guys in Belgium again after that? Because it's sold oh, out. after that? Mm -hmm. Is it sold out? Mm-hmm. What, the, the the one you just said, mm -hmm. the 8,000 mm -hmm. tickets? We love you in Belgium. What? Yeah, you didn't Is know. It? Yeah, yeah, it's sold out. It's mental. Is yeah. that, like, you know, one of your biggest festivals up in announced yet? Are we announced that we're playing that yet? Are we playing one of them? I don't know, mate. Are we? That's why I, I don't need know. to are find we? out. Are we? Are we? Rock, rock Rector. We're playing Rock Rector. Are we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we? we <laughs> oh, That is the noise to make when Someone's you're... Someone's getting fired. No, no. And Tell it me. can't be you. It's probably so, you, Michelle. It's me. Well, I'll take it. I'm going to be there Sunday, July 7th. Rock Rector. Your leg's going to be better this time, though. Hope well, fingers crossed. Oh, that's word, That's all the word, guys. I what? could take up alcohol again and see what happens. Rock Rector. Lotto Arena. Tonight, it's gonna, it's gonna happen. That's a good trio, I think. Do you I, know what I mean? It's a ramp up. It, yeah, it? the only way well, is up. Rock Werther. How would you say it? Rock Werther. That's, that's right. Yeah? Yeah. You say it better, obviously. We're new here.
Thurston.
our best album yeah yes because Fine. why Fight the King. Well, yeah thank you and why why is it your best you'd say because it's our most accomplished musically like we we've built up to this and we'll keep building up to the next you know and um that takes time and hours of practice and working on your craft and bowen and i have found a comfortable place as a as a dialogue between our creative whatever thinking and we speak each other's language more yeah. and the songs are more complete that's basically it, but also I'm singing, which is less annoying for the listener. <laughs> <laughs> How much do you think about the fans when you're creating? The fans come in once we've written the album. We don't think about, I don't think about the fans at all anymore. There were points like in the third album, which was, which for me, I think was my least fluid lyrical writing. Because of our success, I was overthinking and that was kind of coming it was like seeping into mm -hmm. what I was writing whereas now I, I, I absolutely have abolished that by writing at the microphone it's that sense of I'm not here for them I'm here for me and the song mm. and that's completely freed me and that sounds like wanky or contrived but it's not it's, it's the honest truth and like it works for me because we are so grateful of how privileged we are to get and have what we have that we've worked for, mm. but we've been given and gifted by a loyal audience. The way we can show our gratitude the, the most is by working hard and making ourselves uncomfortable and pushing ourselves. And that means not giving people what they think they want, but what we need. That's the important thing. Mm. And that, that takes a sense of separation, creating some sort of wombic thing around an album where you are a slave to the sound and fuck everyone else. And then when after that, the live craft and the dialogue and the magic that's created in a room is everything else that comes after it. That's the visual language of the album. That's the, the product. That's the, the live show. That's the interviews. That's everything that we take very seriously. It's all important because it's not a two dimensional thing. It's magic. And that's created by mindful creating. Thank you for the magic in advance, Bowen and Joe. Thank you very much. Wonderful. Thank you very much for coming and making us feel welcome in Brussels. It's been too long. Thank you. 
This is our last song. We very much appreciate you giving us the love that we needed to start this journey of 2024. I say this at the da, 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 da. I say this with all that I have. Thank you very much. Fuck the king. See you in Antwerp. Bye.